Ooh, what's up, people? This is Mr. Brandon here. And today, Yoko was updated to add one of the most requested features from users of Yoko. And that was stereo returns on the backside of Yoko, which makes it a ton easier to add effects to each band and then bring them back in and not involve merging that signal back together via a mixer or other device. So that's what we're going to do today, update the previous video on multiband compression and update that with these new returns. So let's go ahead and switch over to a fresh rack and inside of that I'm going to create a sick beat. Let's go with this one. Even though what's going through Yoko has nothing to do with this tutorial at all. Anyways, underneath this Dr. Octor X that I've created, I'm going to go to Studio Effects and create the Yoko Band Splitter. I'm going to do this in order from low, mid to high. So underneath Yoko, I'm going to shift and right click in the empty space in the rack below Yoko and go to my Studio Effects and create a Rough Rider because most likely most of the kick will be coming through low and that's where I want to use Rough Rider for is on the kick. Below Rough Rider, I'm just going to create the normal M-Class compressor and then click on that and hit Command D or Control D to duplicate that. Notice that nothing was tied in. I'm going to route that myself. Go from the output of Yoko into the audio in of Rough Rider. Make sure you're in the low section and the returns to the audio out of Rough Rider and keep doing the same for the M-Class for the mid. Remember, I'm going descending in this for the audio input, audio output and everything is hooked up now and we didn't even have to reroute Yoko to the mix channel because all the signals are being returned And as last time said we want to add this as an effect unit, all you gotta do is click on the first device you want to contain in a combinator, and then shift click on the last device you want to contain in the combinator, and right click on all those devices and click combine. And there we go, we have our contained effect patch, and you can go ahead and save that as whatever you would like. And load it up whenever you want. 